reason I stopped you is you're 71 miles an hour as you were passing that white pickup truck on Gansel in a post at 50. So you're 21 miles an hour over the speed limit, and then you were just moving around to pass this car so you could continue to speed here. Sorry, I, I was listening and I was... You know what it is? It's your big ultimate energy. Yeah. That's what it is. I get it. I, I get it. You just, you want to drive fast in this car. This traffic stop came to a stop here at the Medical Plaza, uh, just north of Empire and south of Banner Ironwood on Gansel Road. Uh, we do a ton of traffic stops right here in this parking lot. I've arrested people for criminal speed, for DUI, for driving on suspended, criminal speed, regular speed, all in this parking lot. And it just ends up being the first place out of the 50 mile an hour zone where it's, it's really safe to stop. So we do a lot of traffic stops here. I'm sure the people that work in this medical plaza are probably tired of seeing me stop people right here at this very spot. Are you watching videos while you're driving down the road? Well, sorry, it was a TikTok. Going down the road, I was doing a navigation. So you're watching TikTok while you're driving down the road? But it was on TikTok. Yes, sir. Just right so now. did you just turn on TikTok between when you slammed on your brakes and stopped in the middle of Gansel Road? Or were you watching it while you were driving? I didn't know where to stop there, so no, no, I wasn't necessarily watching it. I put my hands on it and went over to the I didn't know where to pull over. So your phone just magically switched over to TikTok. Yes, okay. Hey man, I hear new things every day. So that's a new one. Let me see your driver's license. So I'm Deputy Slope. I work for the Pinal County Sheriff's Office Traffic Unit. The reason I stopped you is for a criminal amount of speed. Okay, so um, you're more than 30 miles an hour over the posted speed limit. And then you stopped literally in the middle of Gansel Road. Hey, no, you can go, you can go down. I actually wanted you to pull into the LDS Church parking lot there. It's not what Frank says. Frank doesn't, Frank doesn't make the law. Arizona law says you have to pull parallel to the rightmost curb and remain stopped. What Arizona doesn't say is pull into the median. Right. It's super easy. You turn your right turn signal on and you legally change lanes to the right because that's what I expect you to do. All right. Well, you are very deserving of a couple tickets, so you're going to get them and I'm going to go write them and I'll come back. Like, I don't think that's how phones work. I don't think you just like put your phone down, which you shouldn't be holding while you're driving because we have a hands-free law here. Um, so she's wrong from the get-go along with traveling at 35 miles an hour above the posted speed limit. Um, but yeah, like I don't I don't feel like when you put your phone down, it just goes onto a TikTok reel. So we're going to address that with some tickets along with the 35 over and the slamming on her brakes and coming to a stop in the middle of Gansel Road, where she could have just pulled into the LDS parking lot where a hundred other traffic stops have occurred. You can't operate a vehicle while using a portable wireless communication device. Using it means for anything, for navigation, for TikTok, for selfies, for Snapchat, or whatever else you kids are doing these days. Um, so all of that. So those are, that's what we're doing here. Um, you have a mandatory court date. So why do you have an identification card? I got my license suspended. Your license is suspended? So why are you driving? without a seatbelt on at a criminal amount of speed in Santan Valley. And you pulled into the median, which I don't know why I'm standing here in the median, but. So you know the name of this road is Gansel Road, right? This isn't Interstate Gansel. Even if it was Interstate Gansel posted at 65, you would still be doing a criminal amount of speed. That's how far above the speed limit you are. See all that dirt that's over there to the right? That's where we're supposed to be, over on the right curb. Not in the middle, where cars are passing us in the fast lane on both sides. This is a mandatory court appearance because both of these are criminal in nature. And so as I'm traveling down the road, probably 95% of the time, I'm this radar is in a mode that it's getting the speed of vehicles that are coming at me in the opposite direction. But it's funny because people all the time are like, oh, I know your license plate. I'm like, it, it's not the license plate on this car that is going to give it away. It's when I'm already behind you and I've already illuminated my lights. The speed of vehicles coming at me is really what I'm looking for. So by the time they see me, that it, it's already over. That decision's already been made. The reason I stopped you is the speed limit on this portion of Gansel is 45. You're doing 73. That's why you were so far ahead of all the other cars and I can make that U-turn to come in. So you're at a criminal amount of speed, almost 30 miles an hour over the speed limit. 
pretty quick. Everyone writes tickets on Gansel Road. I mean, it is it, Interstate Gansel is a it's a legit phenomenon. We dealt with with several fatals here in the last year just on Gansel Road. So it's something as a member of the traffic unit um, and taking those um, those fatals, having to talk to those families and and um, and everything that goes around with that. We really try to to decrease those excessive speeding violations by being out here a lot. So you're in our system from a really long time ago, and you haven't been in our system for a really long time, which means you were going down a road and you went, no, nah, I don't want to go that way, and now you're living life right. I want to tell you I appreciate that, because that's cool. I appreciate that. Like, that's cool. That's cool to be like, you know, I don't think I want this to be my life. I think I want a life where I drive a 2023 Chevy, um, which is awesome, by the way. Um, and that's cool. In understanding and appreciation of you changing a lifestyle, we did not write you a criminal site. So we keep all that criminal stuff away from you. Now you're doing 73 into 45, so you're still setting a land speed record. But um, I have some discretion. The sheriff really appreciates it when I use it. So I try to do it as much as I can. Um, so we just wrote just for the civil. It is unequivocally the right decision to make right now and uh, I and I, I like working down here because he gives me that discretion and I try to use it when I can. I so all right no problem. Listen, slow down, drive safe. Thanks. Thanks.